Defining the world's most powerful countries come in many forms, from military might to economic strength, political influence, and cultural impact. The most powerful nations in the world shape global economic patterns, maintain a strong military, and establish foreign policies whose effects reverberate all around the world. Countries are ranked with respect to these five attributes, military alliances, international alliances, political influence, economic influence, and leadership. We will be taking a look at the world's most powerful countries in this video. Are you yet to subscribe? Now is the time to do so. Like, share, and comment on this video. Let's take a look at the most powerful countries. At number 10 is United Arab Emirates, with a GDP of $421 billion and a population of 9.77 million. UAE is a federation of seven emirates on the southeast end of Arabian Peninsula. This country in the Middle East is famous for two of its emirates, Abu Dhabi and Dubai, which attracts millions of tourists every year. Before oil was discovered in the mid-20th century, UAE's economy was based mainly on fishing and a pearl industry. When oil exports began in the 1960s, the country's economy rapidly transformed. According to the CIA's World Factbook, the UAE's per capita gross domestic product is parallel with those of leading Western European nations. The UAE has also been named as the most competitive economy in the Arab world by the World Economic Forum. At number 9 is Saudi Arabia, with a GDP of $793 billion and a population of 34.7 million. Saudi Arabia is a country in the Middle East and is known both for its oil and has one of the largest sand deserts in the world. The vast majority of land and the wealth of Arabian Peninsula is within its borders. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia is ruled by a monarch with assistance from 12 appointed ministers. At number 8 is South Korea with a GDP of $1.65 trillion and a population of 51.7 million. South Korea is known for its economic development in a short period of time. The East Asian nation shares one of the world's most heavily militarized borders with North Korea. South Korea has a high-tech, service-based economy and the nation has seen steady growth and poverty reduction since the 1960s. In present times, it is the world's seventh largest exporter and has the 11th largest economy. It is home to the headquarters of Samsung, Hyundai, and it represents two of South Korea's important exports, technology and cars. At number 7 is France, with a GDP of $2.72 trillion and a population of 67.2 million. France, located in Western Europe, is one of the oldest countries in the world and is known for its cultural diversity. The country is home to fashion houses, classical art museums, and its reach extends around the globe through science, politics, and economics. Starting in the Middle Age, France has evolved through kingdom, empire, and finally into a republic. Today, France is a democracy with a separation of power falling between executive, legislative, and judicial branches of government. France is classified as a wealthy, high-income nation by the World Bank. At number 6 is Japan, with a GDP of $5.06 trillion and a population of 126 million. Japan is one of the most illiterate and technologically advanced nations in the world. The country, which is made up of four main islands, is ranked at number 6 on the list of most powerful nations in the world. While most of Japan is covered by mountains and heavily wooded areas, the people lead a distinctly urban lifestyle. Long culturally influenced by its neighbors, today the country blends its Asian traditions with aspects of Western life. Japan has a parliamentary government with a constitutional monarchy. The emperor still holds his title as a symbol of national unity, but elected politicians hold actual decision-making power. At number 5 is the United Kingdom, having a GDP of $2.83 and a population of 66.8 million. The United Kingdom, located off the northwest corner of Europe, is one of the most developed nations in the world. 
The island nation exerts huge international economic, political, scientific, and cultural influence. The nation's global influence has its roots in the British Empire, which formed during the European colonial era and peaked in the early 20th century before embarking on decolonization following World War II. The United Kingdom of today dates to the formation of the medieval Kingdom of England and later the establishment of a constitutional monarchy and parliamentary democracy in the 17th century. The national government is divided between executive, legislative and judicial branches. With a GDP of $3.86 trillion and a population of 83.1 million, Germany takes the first position. The most populous nation in the European Union has one of the largest economies in the world. The country is home to scenic landscapes and over two millennia of history. Germany employs a social market economy and open market capitalism that also carries certain social service guarantees. Its economy is one of the world's largest and Germany is one of the globe's leading importers and exporters. Services which include industries such as telecommunications, healthcare, and tourism contribute the greatest amount to the country's economy. Industry and agriculture are other significant economic sectors. At number three is Russia, with a GDP of $1.69 trillion and having a population of 144 million. Russia is the largest country in the world. The transcontinental country spanning Eastern Europe and Northern Asia shares its borders with 16 countries, the most by a country in the world. Russia as a nation dates back more than a millennium and authoritarian rule has marked much of its history. It was the largest and leading republic of the Soviet Union formed in 1922 and in 1991 when the Soviet collapsed, Russia became an independent nation. Russians directly elect their president and the federal government includes legislative and judicial branches as well as a presidency possessing extensive authority. At number two is China, with a GDP of $14.3 trillion and their population stands at 1.40 billion. China is the most populous country in the world and it houses some of the world's oldest civilizations and has been ruled by Communist Party since 1949. China has been one of the world's fastest growing major economies since 1978 when its former leader installed reforms. A single-party socialite state, China has since moved from being a centrally planned to a market-based economy. China's economy is the world's second largest, trailing only the United States. At number one is the United States, with a GDP of $21.4 trillion and a population of 328 million. The United States is considered to be the most powerful country in the world. It is a constitution-based federal republic having 50 states and its economic and military power is unmatched. The United States economy is the world's largest in terms of gross domestic product and also the most technologically powerful. The most significant exports of the US are computers and electrical machinery, vehicles, chemical products, food and military equipment. The country with the world's largest coal reserves is the US. The United States has the world's largest economy and in 2020, the US had a GDP of $20.93 trillion and the most massive military budget of $778 billion. Now you know the most powerful countries in the world. Do make sure